guys, I've got absolutely nothing for this uh, intro, by the way. Okay, so I just want to tell you guys, this game is absolutely amazeballs. So, so stay to the end of the video, okay, because you're going to want to see how it ends. And trust me, it's a good game. It's a really good game. It's a slow burner, but it's really worth it. So, leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe to the Jolly John Show to help me out and bring more bigger and better videos to you guys. And thanks for watching. Hello, everyone. Jolly John here. You're... Lord and Master of Ceremony here, and welcome back to Observer. Now this is going to be part four. I do very much work, I believe. So when we left, when we last left off, it was a bit of a cliffhanger because I'm just like that, like I. So let's dive straight into this. You know what this reminds me of is Fallout Four. Remember Fallout Four? So hopefully we don't wake up two years in the uh, two hundred years in the future. Chiron Incorporated. Well, how do you do? This is, I hope this is not one of these mindfuck things again. Oh, yes it is. I <laughs> spoke too soon. Wow. Can't, can't use any of that. Oh, wow. Oh, oh, it's changed. It's actually quite nice, this, isn't it? I appear it. I suppose it probably won't be very nice soon, man. But... Let me run! So, what's this meant to symbolize? Voucher. So what's this? This is like the. This looks like it's in the center of things. So I don't know. Need I be going here? Oh. Hello. Adam. Yes. I know it's hard to believe. After all you've seen, but I need you to trust me on this. We don't have much time. Okay. What about the body I found? It's it's complicated. What you found wasn't me. Not anymore. But I'm here right now, and I need your help. If you're my son, prove it. How would I do that? Just try. Tell me something only we would know. Okay, you're a fat bastard. No, 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 no. Nope. What? When I was a child, you know, you'd sometimes wake me up before dawn, go down to the river, and watch the sunrise together. Hoping for that smog to clear just enough that we could see the mountains. And it never happened. <laughs> of course. Of course. And we kept trying, didn't we? Hiding from Chiron. You were hiding here in the stacks. Yes. When I terminated my project, I hid where they wouldn't look for me. In time, I found people who were willing to help me. I managed to retrieve most of my data and carry on with my research. I wonder what his work was then. Oh, research. Where were you working? Ah, there Imagine works. if all your thoughts, your memories, everything that defines you could be transferred into a digital realm. To exist long past your physical body. Beyond limitations. Beyond sickness and death. Beyond being human. Just to keep existing. Sounds like a living nightmare. You haven't changed, have you? I knew you wouldn't understand. But you will. It's so like Soma. Sounded like Soma. Victims. Helena saved your research and smuggled it out of car. Yeah. So we got her killed. Yes. And Amir, too. Now, it wasn't a part of the plan, but I had to. The project was too important, Dad. What about the surgeon? What was his angle? Yeah, Jack. He admired what I was trying to accomplish. Actually, I think he wanted to be me. Uh, how did you end up like this? The killer? I still don't see how the splicer fits into all this. He doesn't. It's 
That's why we didn't see him coming. It was an unforeseen factor. A convenient tool. How did you end up like this? When did you become this digital ghost? Yeah. When the splicer came for me, I had to improvise. I managed to get out before it was too late, hoping they couldn't follow me into the web. But they could. They came after me with a virus. A hunter-killer algorithm. It's eating through my defenses. If they break down, I'll be gone for good. How can we stop it? Oh, we can't. I tried masking my signature, but it was too late. If I could bust out of the building's internal network, I might be able to outrun it. So we need to lift the damn lockdown. down. The source of the signal is well protected. It's like the mother of all firewalls. Ooh. Which gives us only one option. A manual override. That's where you come in. Ah, okay. The source. Where does the signal come from? I couldn't pinpoint the exact location, but I've narrowed it down. Seems to have originated in the adjoining building. The high rise? Yeah. I think it's the epicenter of all this madness. The signal appears to be coming from the upper levels. And Dad? Watch your step. Chiron still has control over that place. And you. Not anymore. Yeah, that's what you think. The more you struggle, the harder they try and get into your head. Oh, this just keeps getting better. Complete mind fuck. Which reminds me. Once you get out, follow the light. That light? Back here. I didn't last long. I thought we were going to be in there for all that. So, it reminds me of Soma because they take what, kind of like take what makes you human, your thoughts, your emotions, and, and all that good shit, and puts it into a digital copy. But in Soma, they were putting a digital copy to send up the space so that they could try and live as digital copies floating in space, if that makes sense. They wanted to live on, but here, it's just one person, it's not like the last of humanity, but it's the same thing, you know. I kind of... That's open... Ah, oh, it's locked. Follow the light. Well, that light up there? I don't know. Because there's a lot of lights. Uh, yeah, so... That's a debate for... That'll go on forever, you know? Does that make you... Does that make you human or not, you know? If it's a digital copy. Ah. Suppose I have to go up here then, do I? Yeah, so the story is actually really cool, this. You know? Uh, this game's more of a slow burner. Oh god, I wonder what that was. Ooh. Yeah, it's a really slow burner here, but... It's, it's really good if, if you... S Ooh. But if you stay with the game, then... It, it's it's really good. It unfolds quite nicely. Oh wow! Woo! This is like a proper sanctuary, is it? Chiron, I'm guessing that's sanctuary. Oh. Well, this is nice. Clicky. Oh, hi again. Speak, woman. Yeah. Nice talking to you. Case log update, okay. Hmm. 
So it's like... Oh, is that... Yeah, they don't work. So it's like the center of everything. Is here, I'm guessing. So I wonder if we're getting to the near the end of the game, if this is going to be the last part of that. Oh, hi. Anyway, keep it together. The phage. Ah, oh, the, the disease thing. So am I infect infected with this then? Oh no, a barrier. How will I get through? Remove your implant. That's what it says. Digital decay. Hello? Joey John here. I'll help you if I can, but I probably won't to be honest. Is someone out there? Help me, please. I can't, I don't know. You. What's going on here? Why are you people in capsule? What's that? They've locked us in. Bastards! We're not even sick! Let us out! How do I open the capsules? I think there's a control room nearby. Just follow the light. I'll do it again. I don't think I really want to open that, to be if honest. You can't help me, please. My son is still out there. His father... He's gone insane. Delirious. I'm afraid he might... Do something to our boy. You can't let that happen. If I can find him, I'll get him out. Thank you. You've always been such a good boy. What did you say? What the fuck you saying? Yeah, I don't want to let these people out, I don't think. That's the thing, like... I don't know, like, why would you put implants in your head in the future? Implants in your head to be this, this and that, because there's so many things that can go wrong. I wouldn't be doing it anyway. No siree, no thank you. Hello? So these are people in here then? I would imagine. Whoops. Nanophage infected area over there. And I'm heading straight into the fucking thing. <laughs> if you people are in capsules, why is there washing up? Can I take that? I feel like I need that. So, this is not like a game where you can run and hide. You know, because there's no place to hide here. So, so uh, I think everyone's in here, the, the walls and stuff. I think that's what's happening. My detective skills. Hello? I want this entire floor purged. Sir, some of the patients are still symptom free. For now, we need to cut our losses. I'm not losing all my subjects out of some. Yeah, oh, I cut off there. I was listening to that. Oh, hello. Am I going... Shit. I'm going in and out of reality again. Hey, 
Hey, you can't get me when I'm in here. Okay, I'll wait for him to go past. If he is. Oh. Run. Oh god, can I even go this way? <laughs> keep going, keep going. Ba, 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 ba. Oh. Camera keeps moving, though. Oh. Well, maybe if I hurried up there, I would have got past them. <laughs> A brave boy, cup of tea. Coming this way. Oh shit, this is a bad idea. Ah! Oh, I need to go that way. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, you can't get me! Oh no! Ah! Okay, hide in here. Oh, there's a lot of crying going on. Quick, 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 quick. Shit, he's right there. Oh no. Whew. I have no idea where the fuck I'm going. Okay. I think we might got clear from that one. Oh my god. Oh dear. What the hell's that? Oh. Hey, stop that. Run. Okay. Oh shit. Oh for fuck's sake. Oh. Well, that was intense. Oh god. As soon as that woman said, Danny, run, I was fucking off. Okay, can I take these out? Without no idea of what's going on. Just 
take you. And you. I had no idea what that could have done, but. Oh. Oh my god, who? Lynn Swanson. Okay. Was that a little collectible I just got? I came here for a collectible. Oh no. Oh no indeed. In a web in a web of fucking cables. Okay. That might as very well be a oil leak, you never know. Can I squeeze past it? No. Ah. Squeeze me, please. Ooh. It looks like some sort of bullshit's about to happen here, guys. Oh no. Don't even know if that's real or not. I think this episode's got to be the scariest episode yet. So we're leaving the best for last. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, I got them. They go the creepy way or the spooky way? Gross. Oh. Is there something at the end of this or something? That I should be aware of. <laughs> That's so gross. Wait. Oh no. Oh, that's disgusting. I need to drink my tea. Am I in a hospital? There must have been a misunderstanding. I was told you decided not to undergo the augmentation procedure. Yes. Just to be clear, you do realize that that drastically decreases your chances of recovery? I... I made my decision. Thank you. I think she wants to, like, die, die a human or something. I'm proud of you. You can do this. I know you can. I'll be there for you. Oh, no.
But she wasn't. I just wanted her to be all right. Why couldn't you save her? <laughs> it should have oh. been you. Hey, what do you mean it should have been me? Do you imagine if the game just ended right here? <laughs> oh, somebody's fallen. It's not me, I don't think. Jesus, there's barely anything left of him. Can he hear us? Yes, but he's very weak. Please make this brief. Dad, it's it's pretty bad. They need to replace a few parts. Hypocrite, and you don't even see it. Hey, I thought I was right. I didn't know any better. You stood on principle when it was her life on the line, but when it comes to saving yourself, you're pragmatic all of a sudden. I had to take care of you. I made a promise to her. Hey. Oh, no, you don't get to use her as an excuse. Not after what happened. What did you want me to do? Oh, give up. That's what you made her do. Every time I look I'm the big guy. I see this monster that killed my mom. We made it. I finally understand. No, I don't think I do understand actually. So I'm the big bad monster that was there. So that's me. Or what? Is that what maybe what Adam perceives me to be? This monster. I'm gonna fucking jump. No, I'm not. Oh. So the mother, my wife on this game, died because she didn't want any implants or nothing in that. She wanted to die. I suppose she wanted to die a human, you know? Which is fair enough. Oh, Adam. Hi. This is a little bit too close for comfort. Adam. What the hell is this? Cora. Cora. You need your way here. Let you in? What about the lockdown? The virus? The virus will get to me no matter what. Here, we're out in the web. It's only a matter of time. You need a place to hide. I need a host. A unique specimen. Attached from the web at large. You lied. The lockdown was just an excuse to get me. Why lie? But what else could I do? They had you so looped in your repressed memories, I had to break you out somehow. Now that you're finally free, we can beat this thing. A host. A host. I guess that's supposed to be me. Oh, little old me. Observer's mind is... I said. 
Detach from the grid. It's the only place where I can hide. Fortress that the virus won't be able to penetrate. Well, that's smart thing. Say I let you in. Then what? Oh, it's amazing. Our minds will merge. Merge? Yeah. It might sound weird, but our minds kind of hook up and plug into each other. Right, right, Sorry, you lost me. You are losing it. Your sanity's hanging by a thread, Dad. But I can help you regain control of your senses. We can help each other. How can I trust you? I can't trust you anymore. You lied. Have it your way. Still up to you. Save us both. You need me to die and go on with this fever dream of existence. Oh no. Anyway, that sight seems tonight. I'm going weaker by the second. Soon. I won't be able to maintain a connection. No, that's horrible. Hey, do you mind not waving that thing in my face, please? <laughs> I can't believe I had to say that. <laughs> so I don't have much of a choice, which is good. I don't, don't think I want a choice. This is like all types of wrong. Pursuit of his grand design. Why should one more make a difference? You're fucking unreal. He was my son. I am your son. So what if he had the real body? You're clinging to a version of me that hated you. As if that was all that made him. Me. Your son. Okay. Why? Why did you kill him? Why? Why? I have no choice. Kill or be killed. The virus. Adam said it moves. He figured out how dangerous you are. Maybe. And maybe he realized he had succeeded. He created the superior version of himself. And it terrified him. He tried to kill me. The splicer was breathing down my neck. You sent him. Appreciate it. And his memory is supposed to go after you. But the drugs and paranoia took over. After that, you went full on fair. Hey. The mind is not a toy. Ironic. Coming from an observer. Superior? So what the hell makes you better? He was driven by hatred. <clears throat> obsessed with the idea of not becoming you. He never came to understand. But I did. Just help me out, man. You're losing me. We're all facts of nature, Dad. Your choices, your mistakes, they were all unavoidable. You can't blame us for what we are. You killed all those people. Why did the others have to die? I couldn't let any word of this reach Kyle. He would stop at nothing to track me down. Way to cover your ass. Think of me what you will. But you know the corporation. They would claim this gift for themselves. I want to share it with them. I regret what I had to do. But it was necessary evil. Let's end this. I'm tired. Let's get this over with. 
you think you're ready to make your choice? Oh no, I have to make a choice. Will you let your son die? Or will you save him? Oh no, <laughs> I have to make a choice. Okay, I embrace Adam. I can't believe I said that. As is that really Adam, my son? No, I think I think reject. I'm gonna. I think reject because that's not really my son. My son, my actual son, the the, the real son, died. Is what I think. And I don't trust this this version of Adam. Put down in the comment section below what you guys would do. Okay, I'm going to put reject Adam. See what happens. My son is gone. <laughs> I'm not sure anymore who or what you are, but you will pay for what you did. Yeah. That's disappointing. Just hoping we could do this the easy way. But. Since you failed to see reason, I'm afraid I'm gonna have to insist. No, no you won't. What? Break into my brain? What do you think I've been doing for the past hour? I've been chipping away at you ever since you got into that capsule. Hey. You're breaking my heart, asshole. Oh, Dad. Just your mind. I didn't want to do this, but you gave me no choice. I want to live. No, you don't. Forever in a day. Go to hell. After you. Oh shit. Oh. Caution. Low synchronization. Administer synchrosine. Oh. That's me there. I regret it must end this way. You see, without a willing host, I need to force you out. Fortunately, I have found a better place for you. Sorry, Dad. Oh! That's Adam there now. So me... I'm whatever this camera is. So that means that Dan, the character I've been playing as, is now dead once this battery runs out. I can't move the camera or anything. Oh. Oh, it's the ugly guy from the start. Oh no, he talks so slow. Hurry up, asshole, my battery's going. Thank you. So I was... Oh, I'm the ugly bastard from the start now. So that right there... What time is it? I've been playing this for over an hour, guys. So that right there is... Me, Dan. So my character from the start... Is... Is dead. Well, from what I can imagine. And Dan... The guy I've been playing is like the... The, the body. The actual Dan Lazarski. Is... Adam, now. 
And the character I've been playing is just dead. The lockdown has now been lifted. Thank you for your cooperation. You have a couple of oh. Oh, what? Oh, is this down here? Oh! You shot me! Oh god! <laughs> so... Okay. Yeah, that's the start of the game. Oh, oh wow, so... That, uh, the ugly bastard from the start, the baldy guy, was that done when I started punching him? I don't know. So if the, either that was done, and then I just got killed and shot, or it wasn't done, and he was punching him for no reason. Or Dan was in that robot, that Janus, Robot thing and died. So either way Dan's dead. So Dan Lazarski, the body of him, is Adam. So Wow. So that's the thing, like if you take a human mind if you take a human mind and digital that make it into a digital copy <laughs> and so that is it still human, is it not? I don't, I have no idea. But I would love to hear it from the from you guys in the comment section below. So this was a really good game, guys. I actually really enjoyed this. I don't know. It might be a longer episode than now or something. I'm not too sure. But with that being said, guys, please leave a like. Subscribe to the Joey John Show because you get more content like this and this fucking amazing game. I loved it. It was really good. It's a shame I haven't played this before, actually. And what would you guys do? Reject Adam or embrace Adam? I'm curious to see what you guys would do. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!